Hello again, everyone, and welcome back to Dragon Age Origins. We're back here in Orzammar for the, um... Don't, don't, I don't know where my train of thought was going there, but it's certainly nice to be in some some other location, you know. It's, it's, it's quite new to me. I don't know what's going on. Let's head to the tavern, then, since we probably have quite a few things we can do in here, I'd imagine. So you're a Grey Warden. You think I'm impressed? You should be. Cora? I trust Vala, stranger. You must be the Grey Warden we heard about. Welcome to Tapsters. I'm Cora, your hostess. How may I serve you? Oh, nice. I hear about the... So you come to Tapsters. Hear about the city. I guess you're not asking for anything official, or you'd be at the Shaper It. But I can certainly give you a mole's eye view. The only place I should see while I'm here. The nobles stay upstairs, except when they're slumming. You'll find the assembly there. The palace, the Shaper It, and plenty of estates. Down from here is just Dust Town or the Mines, so my recommendation is avoid. It's not so, part of the city, just some old tunnels where the castles build their nest. No one goes there if they can help it. But if you want fun, your best bet is the Proving. What's the Proving? It's a chance for all the best fighters in Orzammar to test their skills. There's a tournament today. Arenas between here and the Diamond Quarter. Lovely. What's a Shaper? It's the Bureau of all the Shapers in Orzammar, led by the Shaper of Memories. If you're from the surface, I guess you'd call them scholars. They keep all of our records, laws, genealogies. You got questions about Orzammar's history, and don't mind answers in words as long as your leg, that's the place to go. <laughs> Where can I find the Shaper of Memories? He'd be in the Diamond Quarter. Pardon, the Nobles District. Upstairs from here, however you call it. I'm looking for someone. I, maybe I can help. For a man named Ordell. He's the one in the corner, still dusty from the mines. Don't expect him to be chatty. Very well. Thank you very much, Cara. Speak to the people. Nevin? Afternoon, stranger. You looking for a stool to share a brew? Uh, who are you? Name's Naveen. I fight with Prince Balin's expeditionary field unit. Yourself? I'm Craig, Gray Warden. Figured as much. Mm. Good folks, Wardens. I was in the deep roads when that one came by. What was his name? Dukan, Dunka. Uh, something like that. Duncan. You knew Duncan? I met him, sure. Good man. Solid. He knows what we go through in the deep roads. Not many do. Not even the ones who live this close. You have to be on the front lines. Sounds like a bit of a grim place, especially if it's infested with Darkspawn. You work for Balin? I go where I'm sent, fight when I'm there, and leave politics where it belongs. Who's your unit fighting? Darkspawn. Not much use in turning our weapons elsewhere while those vermin still live. I've never been the Deep Roads. Every Grey Warden ends up there. That's where they send you when you're ready to leave this world. Go die in the dark, putting away as many vermin as you can. Getting more crowded these days, though. Lots of people interested all of a sudden. We go back tomorrow, and we're not the only ones. Hmm. Who's sending you out? Balin ordered us in at first bell. He's splitting us into four teams to search for some of the lost tigs. Looking for signs of Branca, I guess. Seems to be who everyone's after. Branca? Who's Branca? Branca was a paragon, some kind of great smith or whatnot. But she went batty and let her old house into the deep roads more than two years ago. No chance she could have survived. And a lot of good men are gonna die looking for her corpse. Excuse me. This brew is starting to taste awful bitter. Fair enough. Deeper time for the And in the the Stock this up our vagor, the jab in dar deck tavir riding. For dashebna gorham, rocks up our gun, where I'm got Yep, I think he has lost his marbles. Uh, moving on. <laughs> Good grief. The surface must be so interesting. Oh, it is not at all. I told him I don't understand why the provings aren't open to everyone. I mean, it's how the ancestors show their favor. Do they really need our help to decide who's worthy? And then he practically slapped me. <laughs> Lord Denik Helmi, honored desher of the Orzammar Assembly, and 
terrible disappointment to my esteemed mother, who doesn't like me spending time in taverns. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying, right? On the surface, there are no casts, and it works fine. Am I right, Warden? A controversial opinion for a dwarf in the assembly. Very good. I guess someone already told you I was good for nothing, drinking my life away at tapsters. Or did they leave off a greatest shame to ever fall upon the assembly? I'm always like that one. You know, most smiths and tavern keeps would make decent dashes if we gave them a chance and a seat in the assembly. Or is the Mara so mired in tradition no one bothers asking if the casts are even necessary? So you get to vote on the next king? Me and 79 other fine, upstanding examples of how someone who's born into every privilege inevitably wants more. <laughs> They're not fond of my views on equality. Clearly. How's the caste system work, anyway? Badly. <laughs> You're serious? Well, it's simple, I guess. The king and elected deshers of the assembly are at the top. Then it's the nobles. Then the warriors and all the craftsmen. At the bottom are servants. The castless and criminals are below even that. Your caste is determined by that of your same-sex parent. And that's where you stay your whole life, whatever your skill. Well, that's a lot of rubbish. As you wish. I wasn't expecting you back. I guess you realize that I, think I doubt king. either candidate has been outside the diamond quarter in his life. But Lord Harrimont seems a bit more forgiving. Prince Balin's brilliant, I'll give him that, and subtle as sin. But I don't think anything in Orzammar matters more to him than winning. As you wish. So, that, that seems like a harsh system to me. People should be judged on their abilities rather than anything else, but hey ho. They're everywhere! I can't take it! Oh god, are you okay? Get away! You'll change like the rest! Monsters hidden in all my friends! What are you talking about? They follow you. Once you are in the story, they possess your friends and follow. See? I found copies. All from the same pen and older than the ones in song. Dormant my ass. Take them. I want out. I won't disappear chasing a lie. I won't. Uh... Right. Interesting. Bottles all around? Of course. Um, Ordell. What are you looking at, stranger? Are you Ordell? I could be. What business is it of yours? I met your daughter. I have no daughter. Could be you met a castless whore claiming she was once mine. Wow, that's nasty. If you don't take Delinda back, she'll die. What? You think she'd die just to keep that thing? She knows what she has to do to come home. I never wanted her gone. Just the little cur. Can't she see she'd have a better life if she got rid of it? He's a baby, not a cure, and she loves him. Look, just tell her... We never meant to hurt her. It just seemed best that... Oh, just tell her to come home. Her mother and I are waiting for her. Well, thank God for that. Some people ain't, ain't got no respect. Yeah, dear me. Right, so let's quickly nip over back to the dust town. Shit, where is it again? Oh, it's this way. And I'll let Zelinda know of the good news. Everything's going on, Ozama. It just seems like everyone's arguing with, uh, arguing with each other. Never mind the Dwarven Commons, it's like being in the House of Commons. English jokes. Um, Zelinda. You're back. I thought you weren't coming. What did he say? Your father wants you both to come home. Both of us? I don't believe he said that. I've never heard him refer to my son as anything but trash. He calls him it. But maybe. Maybe mother convinced him. Or you did. Oh, my friend. I cannot thank you enough. 
If this were a story, my son would grow to manhood and pledge himself as a knight in your service. When he grows up, I will send him to you. I promise. Blimey. Well, at least that was a happy ending to that, to that little story. How on earth could you honestly dis disown your own son like that? Just because it wasn't the, 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 the gender you wanted it. Honest to God. Terrible. Disgraceful. Right. <clears throat> so, where were we? Let's go to the, check the other side of... Um, the other side of the uh, commons. I hear there's a new blight coming. How terrible. Indeed. The great paragon Branca will never return. The ancestors have taken her from this world. Probably. Figor's imports. Key required. Great. We have no key. I miss old Indran. He was a good man. No Grangler Bormo. I knew I should have stuck to common nugs. I've gone and lost them too. I'll never find them the way they skitter. Common nugs? I don't like those. They look dirty. No way I'm going back to that supplier in Dust Town. <sighs> Guess I'm shutting it down. These things dangerous? You gotta boil them before roasting, but otherwise, no, safe as sand. Some people swear they make good pets. May as well leash a turnip, I say. Tch, stay in nugs, I'll send them your way. On you, stranger. Only need one to turn this around. A lost nug. Find uh, Nugrang Laboma has lost his nug inventory. Find one of them to get him back on his feet. A nug. Uh, excuse me. I um. Do you have a moment? I do not. Thank you. No, I'm I'm only kidding. I'll speak to you. You look like you're not from around here. Yes, you could say that. Oh, wonderful! I've been trying forever to find someone who really knows the surface world. I don't suppose you've heard of something called the Circle? My companion here is a senior enchanter of the Circle. Oh, my lady, it's an honor. I've never met an actual mage. Is it true you can manipulate nature's forces with your mind? Like you were born with lyrium in your veins? Don't let the glamour fool you, child. Wielding magic is a dangerous occupation and a great responsibility. Uh... uh... Why is a dwarf interested in the circle? I've been trying to reach someone there for years. I've sent missives with every caravan, but I never get a reply. I want to know if they would accept me for study. You want to leave Ozma? I want to go to the circle to study. I don't want to do magic. No dwarf can cast spells, but I don't see why I shouldn't study it. Uh, it would what? be a valuable exchange. Orzammar would learn of one of the great natural forces of the surface. And the circle gains direct access to our knowledge of lyrium smithing. And what would the messenger get? Uh, no, I won't say that. I can bring the circle your request. That would be wonderful. My name is Dagna, daughter of Janar of the Smithcast. Tell them I've already begun reading the Taventer Imperiums for Tikum Kadab, and it's just fascinating. Did you know the Imperial Magister Lords once had genealogies of every human family known to produce a mage child? Jesus Christ. She's so enthusiastic and adorable. I'm glad we're helping her. <gasps> she oh, seems very energetic. Right now, I'll be waiting by my father's shop. Ah, don't go packing your bags. There's no guarantee you'll actually. Okay, Garin. Greetings and welcome to Garin Garinson's luxury goods shop. Garin Garinson. There are a lot of you, and I've never seen one of those before. The things they come up with. One of those. What? Saying? what? Are you all right? Oh, I, I, I was hoping you. Wouldn't notice. Most people don't anymore. Or maybe they're too polite to mention it. I had a little incident a few years back. Uh, too much time with the raw lyrium ore, you know. <laughs> maybe it was a bad vein. I, uh, I cut myself and the dust got straight in the blood. Since then, it's been a little hard for me to concentrate. Ah. Except when forging, then I'm straight as an arrow. Best work I've ever seen. L -l -l Look around the shop. See for yourself. I don't understand. What happened to you? Well, it's the lyrium, you know. Raw blood of the earth. It's more alive than you and me. M -m -m Most of the time, that's no problem. When it's all bundled up in a piece of steel, it'll leave you alone. But 
handling the ore directly, so sometimes you get burned. It, it's not just your skin it takes off. It'll burn directly into your m mind. Aren't you immune to Lyrium's effects? Aye, of course we are. W -w -w Weak surfaces like you touch the raw ore, and you'll bleed from your eyeballs in hours. W -w weird seeing how b -b big you are. <laughs> Even surface dwarves lose it. Us down here, though, b -b -b we should be able to handle it just fine. Only not too much, and not every day, and not breathing the dust, and not direct in the blood. Ancestors' own bad luck. <laughs> so I can lure him into crazy. Not crazy, just a little forgetful. Don't worry, I'm fine when I work. Just look at my wares. I have the best blades here. Enchanted to hold f fire, ice, anything you want to put in it. Fair enough. Right, best in the trade, you know. See what he's got going on, bless him. He's enthusiastic, at least, which is the main thing. Uh, doesn't really have a lot going on, though, does he, to be fair? Nothing uh, overly interesting. Oh, wow, that's a, real, that's a really nice ring. Unfortunately, 87 gold. Jesus. Fuck. <laughs> that's certainly interesting, isn't it? See, how... Uh, bloody hell. That's, that's one expensive ring. I don't know what that. I don't know what's that way. The diamond cores that way. Sister, smile on you. Uh. Okay. I guess maybe we will carry on this way. See what's down here. Anything interesting at all? Oh god, this looks. Oh, there's a nug. There's also a runestone. On shapers. Hey, you wrangle the dog into a box, ready for delivery to Burma. Excellent. What's this? A human? Do we make these tunnels tall enough for humans? <laughs> Sorry, wow. but I cannot allow you past the front lines without Adesha's permission. And I've heard nothing of any new patrol scheduled to leave today. Will you let me pass? Into the deep robes? Not without a full unit of soldiers to back you, my friend. Or a Desher's permission to risk yourself. Orzammar can't afford to lose its citizens or honored guests on casual visits to the deeps. Fair enough. What do you know about Paragon Branca? What anyone knows. She went out there with her entire house and she's never coming back. You don't think maybe she's still there, Commander? She is a Paragon, after all. And now she's an ancestor. No one lasts two years in the tunnels. Fine on my role-playing game, she's probably down there somewhere. <laughs> Are the dark spell in the old danger in these tunnels? Of course not. Down here, you're bound to run into giant spiders, deep stalkers, and other vermin. Lovely. Deep stalkers? Ugly beasts they are. Walk on two legs, but they have the head of a worm. Ugh. Hunting packs. Watch out. They're not afraid to take on a group their own size. Are there, are there no dwarves past this point? A few outposts. Legion of the Dead, mostly. Fools that they are. Some scavenger types, too. Legion of the Dead? It's an independent company of soldiers. They accept no command but their own. Anyone who can bear arms can join, no matter his crimes. <laughs> or sanity. They hold a funeral when they join, and swear their only goal is a glorious death. I should go? Aye. For your sake... So we can't go to the deep roads until we have a permission from a de permission from a Desha, right? Well, we'll go and give this nug to Bormo. Go on, I'm out of the nug game. Got nothing to sell. I've got a nug for you here. Taraka, I'm back in the game. Such as it is, I don't have much besides gratitude. But find a bunch more of these, and I'll toss you whatever I found. Okay, so if I find nugs, I can take take them back to him. Oh, there's a nug there. Nuggo. This little tab highlighting thing is actually very, very useful. Because the, 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 there's a floor carving here, which I didn't see before. And the layout of the city of Ozumar. I see there's a document as well. Oh, there's a nug over there. Nugs everywhere. Exactly how the hell they make it all the way around here, I don't know. Is there any in, in, any in Dust Town, perhaps? Since we now have the quest, so maybe one will spawn in Dust Town. We might as well have a little look for them. Oh, 
Assembly Directive. The key to the city. Lovely. Any nugs? Doesn't look like there's any nugs. Damn. I thought there'd be tons of nugs down here for whatever reason. I don't know why, but... I thought it might have had something. Obviously not, though. If only the Grey Ones still had those griffins, it'd be uh, considerably better. I can hear a nug, I swear. I can hear something... Oh, there's one over there. Nug, 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 nug. Thank you. There's a document there. There's a nog there as well. So, tell me, you have any children, grandchildren? I don't know, great-grandchildren? Drawn propriety. I think I have any children at all. You have to know I've spent most of my life in the circle of Magi. You just seem like the grandmotherly type to me, I don't know. I suppose I'll take that as a comment on my demeanor and not my age. Mages aren't <laughs> forbidden to marry or anything, are they? It's not such an outlandish question. Isn't it? What sort of man would marry a mage, do you think? Well, how about another mage? There are just as many men as there are women within the circle, as I recall. That sort of union is not encouraged. Although that does not stop us from seeking out each other's company from time to time. All right. I... All right. Okay, so... Well, you don't seem quite when it... so grandmotherly to me anymore. <laughs> Good. I would hope not. So Wynn's actually a slut. No, I'm only kidding. Um... But, yeah. So, the proving is there, which is interesting. I want to take these nugs back to, uh, Bormor, Bormor, whatever, whatever his name is, first. Bormor. Oh. You're the best wrangler I've ever seen, but there's more out there. You're the best rank. You're the, you're the best. I trust Vala. There we go. My nug wrangling friend. So we've got about what? What's that? 12, 24, 30, 48 silver. Yeah. That'll do. Yeah. Let's let's head into the proving area and see what we can find in there. See if there's anything that's, that that might pique our interest. God, this is quite a big area. Oh, they can't don't wait kill to each watch other Kyoto in the arena, do they? So accomplished. I mean, why would anyone find that entertaining? Well, it's combat. It's always entertaining. I heard a bunch of Haramont supporters drop down at the last minute. Ooh. That's a can't lock that door. There's a bunch of fans around here. Oh, there's a master, though. Good day, stranger. Welcome to the Proving Arena. We're still closed until the fighters make their preparations, but come back this afternoon if you want to watch the show. Sounds like fun. I'll, uh, well, uh, well, we'll say what show. Prince Balin called a citywide proving this afternoon to honor King Endrin's memory. All the best fighters in Ozomar will face each other in sight of the ancestors and win honor for their champions. Sounds like fun. I'll come back then. Enjoy our grand city. That sounds like an interesting thing. There's a wall carving behind the door, which we can't get to right now, but we'll certainly come back at uh, some other point. No doubt we can uh, get some more out of the proving. Maybe we'll be able to compete in the proving. That's most likely going to happen, you know, to be honest. Of all oh. the mages I've met, you have to be the first one I can honestly say I've really liked. <laughs> Why, thank you, Alistair. I am quite touched. That's cute. I like you too, Alistair. I imagine my son would have grown up to be someone like you. Your son? I thought you said you were never married. <laughs> That's true. I never have been. I... Oh. <laughs> then this wasn't before you joined the Circle. I joined the Circle at the age of nine. So, no. <laughs> Do you still like me? Uh, yes. 
Why wouldn't I? Good. It appears you got away from the Chantry just in time. <laughs> so she she's wind's been wind was putting herself about then. That's uh not something I expected, but hey ho. You learn something new about someone every day. I shall Let's go to the diamond quarter. <laughs> Enough of all this nonsense. Alright, so what are we going to find in here then? Dwarves, probably. So Adal Helmy. You, you have come at a difficult time. The higher class you are. Is ailing for Unless you're actually team. on the surface. <laughs> the, the closest surface you to the higher class you are. Yep. Kind of, kind of defeats the point of the, them not liking surfaces, but hey. Uh. Warden arrives in Orzammar, undoubtedly to offer assistance to Lord Harrowmont. The public has a right to know. What's a human doing? Oh, must be the Grey Warden we heard about. <laughs> Why is there like a random weapon rack just sitting there? I, I, I didn't really expect to be able to just casually just 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 take a a mace. Lady Dace, hello. This has dragged on too long. It's an insult to King Endrin's memory. Does sound like it's dragging a bit. To be fair. Orzammar Gal, Orzammar Cryer. News of the hour. Does Lord Harrowmont think that Orzammar can hold off the dwarves forever? The assembly demands an answer. The public has a right to know. The royal palace. Oof, interesting. <laughs> oh my, a surfacer in Orzammar. Yes. Indeed. It's quite a big area, this, isn't it? Considering. Shaperous. Hmm. Okay, then... Uh, I think we shall end this episode here, guys. And we'll pop into all of these little areas in the next in the next one. Yeah, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you've enjoyed. If you did, then please like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends. And I'll catch you in the next episode of Dragon Age Origins. Thanks again, guys. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.